Hello, everybody. We're at the Houston International Quilt Festival right here in Houston, Texas. And today, I'm so excited. We've got Yoko Saito from Japan. And you may recognize Priscilla Noble, who has been on the quilt show and, of course, brought the beautiful works of Yoko Saito to the quilt show. And Priscilla's going to kind of act as our interpreter today. Is that right? Yes, that is. So welcome, Yoko Saito, to America. America. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yes, it's great to have you here. She's so thankful that her quilts are in the exhibition this year and that everybody's able to see them. It's fabulous. Well, I got to know you and your work because Priscilla is your ambassador to the United States with bringing your beautiful quilts and your work. Nikki san ga saisho ni Saito san no koto wakatta no ga atashi no soro no kiru to ka Saito san no mono wa no ika ni motte kita mo hata e shitta desu. And I understand uh, that you know me. So she said she she didn't know when she heard your name that this was you, but when you she saw your quilts, she said, "Oh, that's so famous!" And I've known your quilts for a long time, so she's so excited to meet you as well. Well, it's the mutual admiration society, is what we say. Uh, your style is really almost exactly opposite than her hand traditional style, yes. but it's so fun. It is. <laughs> she would love to try it, but she's not sure that you know she hasn't done the machine quilting that right. you've done. <laughs> Maybe you stay do your thing and I'll stay doing my thing. That's <laughs> so one of the things that I would like to ask today is first of all just about the heritage of textiles in Japan. Is this something that you did as a child? Uh, was it something that you did in school? これはあの日本でね、あのその記事とかあのの、あのことちょっと話したいんですけど、先生はこれは小さい時に小さい時からやってらっしゃるんですかね。えっと、日本ではあの、パチワークっていうのは本当に1900何十5年くらいからあの、
an idea and spin it so it became yours. やはりちょっと違うね、色とかちょっと感じになってきたんですけど、それどうやってそのアンティーク so in the beginning, they didn't have a lot of the fabrics in Japan that had the same colors. So she was always looking for patterns like antique quilts and that faded out colors like the antique quilts. But over the years, she's changed that a little bit. So she travels, she loves Sweden and Scandinavia. Oh, okay. And so in some of her books, like the Scandinavian Quilts book, you'll see she has a lot of blue grays, whites and blues, and that sort of um, started to inform her color change. So you can kind of see the changes. The, the transitions the is happening. Let's let our viewers see some of these uh, the bags, I suppose, because they've got patchwork and they've got um, details of embroidery on them. So just talk about this a little bit. Let's talk about this a little bit. そうですね。あの、やはりちょっと歩行の this bag uh, is in um, the uh, bags book. We have one um, everyday bags and this was inspired by a Scandinavian design and she loves to take patchwork and put embroidery and things in it as well. It's really beautiful. Let's look at the other one that also has the beautiful embroidery on it because we, we can't have them here and not have these viewers go, well, you're not showing me the bags. <laughs> <laughs> In Japan, um, many people like to carry bags. There's not a lot of room for big quilts, and so people love to show off their handwork by doing bags. That's great. And, I'm sorry. And she likes to make them so they're very usable by okay. people. Practical. And so even on the, um, on the ends here, um, she has little embroideries yeah. and designs and zippers. I love that. The other bag is now primarily patchwork. で、これはほとんどまあパチワークですよね。はい。もうこれはあの、フリーに線を引いて、で、作っていったものです。で、これもあの、本のために、あの、作ったものなんですけど、あの、出版社の方からこれはあの、カフェオレというテーマで作品を
<laughs> and we're so excited that you could spend some time with us today and visiting with the quilt show. And Priscilla, arigato. And everyone, you need to go find uh, on the quilt show Priscilla Noble's show because she will feature a lot of Yoko Saito's quilts and the books and the projects that are there. So this was just a fun little addendum and I'm so happy that we had this time today.